So, um, I don't know how long ago um, I was attacked by those uh, eerie looking creatures. Got knocked out, but I'm surprised she didn't kill me. I'm still alive, I think. I still have two arms, two legs. And luckily these cannibals aren't that smart, so they left an axe right below me so I can escape. And it seems to me this is where they store their food. Because I've been into one of these caves here in Japan and it's amazing how cold it is. It's like a natural born refrigerator so I guess it's really the best place to store fresh meat. Like this guy over here, he doesn't look that fresh. And yes, uh, you probably uh, have noticed some of the new icons and whatnot. They've added two updates since the last episode, so you'll be seeing some stuff. This is the visibility icon, which I'm not really a fan of, but I'll keep it on for now. Let's just... I'm not going to go deep into the caves, because obviously that was not a good idea in the last episode, so the goal of this episode is to head back home alive because if they kill me one more time I believe it's game over they're not gonna give me a second chance gosh lots of alcohol over here some medicines I'm really up oh, never mind I thought I was low on health but now I just need to find a way to escape from this cave See, this goes down, right? Oh, poor guy. What's this? Uh, a compass? A map for the cave? That's neat. And some snack bars. I guess we can kind of use the compass to navigate back to where we live. Which is north, I think. I'm not sure. Ah, that's the way out. Alright, so literally right next to where I was being hanged. The cannibals were... were kind enough to... Um, <laughs> toss down the rope so I can get back up on the ground anytime. I, I just want to quickly have a glance around the cave, not, not going too far as soon as I see one of those... Uh, Mutants, I'll just run back over here. But for now, just just a little bit of exploration. Shall we? So far it's been a straight road, so it shouldn't be that hard to get back to the get back to where we came from. Whoop, hello. Are you friendly? I'm guessing not. <laughs> this is also not something I really want to do. You've noticed I've killed a lot of cannibals in the last episode. About five of them, so we've killed, including this guy, seven cannibals in past episodes. And I I wanted to stay friendly with them. Not hostile, but they they really don't give me, you know, the chance to stay friendly, because they just instantly attack in a way. I gotta drink something. Uh, some soda, blueberries. And I think we can knock this. Can we? Maybe not. Hmm. Now ah, there we go. I just make sure there's no weird creatures up ahead. Ah, looks like a dead end.
See, that's the same picture I found in the near the grave by the yacht. So these guys must have been the same crew. The the rebreather. Oh, so that's something. That's how we use the air canister we got from the yacht. So I guess we can can be used to swim underwater. Current air charge. 10 minutes. So that's convenient. Some more ropes. The practical caver. Well, didn't really save you guys, did it? Alright, so we came from the left side. We can keep on going forward. But again... Uh, are these bats? Oh, these are bats. And I can kill them! I'm sorry! Aren't you guys supposed to be, like, running away? I'm disturbing your... your night-night time. I uh, kinda suggest that there might be, like, a huge Batman-ish creature up ahead. So I'm gonna head back. I got, uh... an... rebreather. A rebreather. So... I came from this side, right? Yeah. So, at least we have something to take back to our home. We're not heading back uh, blank-handed, so that's good. I'm just hoping that it'll be nighttime outside. Yep. There should be a rope somewhere around here. Just gonna make sure I have a source of light in case it's nighttime up ahead. Alright, here we go. At some point, we will come back. Because we need to explore these caves. There might be some hint to where my kid is at. And where are we? It's uh, starting to get dark, it seems. So we really don't have much time to fool around. But see, this is what I hate. Like, I can under I can respect their culture. The fact that they eat humans. Alright, I guess that's how it works. We eat meat, too. So, I guess they prefer human. That's fine. But, like, they, they play with them. Like, these guys... They're pretty much fucked up in a way. See? This is not a ritual, it's just having fun. Poor guys. Nothing in it. Some sodas. Although this does look like their um, main base or main village. It looks very much well populated, so we gotta be hurry. See, they're back. No time to fool around. Let's head back. I don't know where to go. Um, where's my compass? Uh, we will go north. We'll keep running towards north. Hope I'll find the our home, or... We just need to find water. So, oh, shit, that freaked me out. Forget them. Keep running. Again, we just need to find water. And as soon as we find a source of river or ocean, we can head back home. They're still following me? Need light. Yeah, they're still coming. Leave me be! Go away! That's the eighth cannibal I killed. Unless he's still alive. I think they, they gave up. So I'm guessing that's the mountain we came down from. Because this way is the north. And that's the beach where we originally... 
went around in the sea expedition. And am I seeing a piece of cockpit? It looks like a cockpit of a plane, doesn't it? Yeah, it definitely looks like one. Yeah, it's the cockpit. I'm not sure how deep the water here is. We can try the rebreather over here for the first time. Nice. It's not that deep, so I guess we don't need to waste uh, the air canister. Nice. Alright, let's get this away. Some circuit boards. Well, these pilots didn't survive. There's no radio or anything that looks like one. It's all torn apart by the piece of glasses from the cockpit. We still haven't found the tail of the plane, though. And, of course, flare gun. Nice. We're not going to be using yet. I guess this is more of a an emergency thing. So we'll stick with the uh, torch for now. And again, that's the mountain we came from. So we will keep on heading... Let's see. Uh, northwest alongside the river so if I'm correct we should uh, run into one of those execution towers where they hang poor poor people I'm glad we haven't run into any more oh hey buddy you go inside the water I'm not gonna even bother poking him. It's nice to see somebody in this dark. Yeah, we might need to get wet again. Let's see if we can um, jump and try not to get wet. Yep. Ah, well. Good enough. Now, I'm not sure right or left. I'm guessing left. Towards the west, towards the beach. I hear him. Yep, he found me. He must have seen the fire. I need a big open space to fight if these guys are hostile. Uh, an arrow. Give me some time. Hey. These guys are different guys, uh, they're not the skinny ones, they're the blueies. They live up on the north. I should be friendly with these guys. Right? Uh, <laughs> he's saying otherwise, yeah. That's the skinny ones. Damn it. Uh, wow, they're just literally everywhere. I don't think I can survive this. If I just end up fighting, there's more than eight. I just need to head back home. Do you see them? Do you see? They're literally hunting me! I just... Need a better light. By the way, time doesn't stop. 
when you're in the inventory screen. Ouch! There we go, there we go. So, y you remember him, right, Tommy? There should be a house over there. I honestly don't want to leave these guys to my house, but there's really no option left. One, two, three. Three of them. Maybe I can take them out. Oi. Now you. Come back. Is that it? Is that all you got? That was easy. Just one bash with a wooden torch. Crispy cannibals. I don't know why, but I'm just taking him home for, for no reason. I hope my home's still up there, not destroyed. See light. And there we go, sweet home! Finally, after after a long adventure, I see you guys haven't uh, made any kids yet. Starting to rain. I'm honestly not sure what I'm going to do. We can explore caves, but I feel that... Oh, they're still there. You see them down the stream? They're kind of roaming around. Again... Not really sure what I'm supposed to do. We can still keep on exploring. I want to definitely go down the cave at some point when we are more well equipped. I'm not sure what kind of uh, gear we can get in the future. And there's the rainbow. Perfect for wrapping up this episode. <laughs>